Which one did you just have, right? Uh, see, I was for the con, man. Con, all right? Because they're they're not they're not gonna get it anyway, so it doesn't matter what they say. That's really that's why we can't be uh, bothered by the scoffers. We have to. Uh, uh, be, be, uh, uh, Shit. I'm trying, I'm, to think of the con. I'm trying to think of another word for it. We can't. Con. 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 Well, you know what? I just let this. I just let this next one speak. This is uh Isaiah 50, and verse 7. For Yahweh Bashir Al Shai, the Most High Power, will help me. Therefore shall I not be confounded. Therefore have I set my face like a flint, and I know that I should not be ashamed. All right. So the scriptures say it best. We know that. We won't be ashamed. Yahweh Hashem Al Shai is for us. There's nothing these people can do. The words uh, don't mean anything to us. All right, because we we know where our foundation is at, so they can say whatever they want. All right, they a bunch of retards anyway. We're, Lord, when we're the uh, the gods and the kings that's about to be uh, uh, resurrected upon this earth, so they're but just a bunch of peasants. All right, the heathens are a bunch of peasants, and the two thirds of our people are just a bunch of uh, confused idiots. I don't know what's going on. So we yeah. have the peace this war regardless of what people say or what they think. All right, yet no matter if you have to give up uh, the love of your family, the love of your friends, your status in the world. All right, you have to forsake all that uh, just for this, just uh, just just for the faith, uh, uh, for 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 hoping that you may possibly even receive salvation. We don't even know for sure. This is uh, Joshua one. And um, I start at five. There shall not any man be able to stand before thee all the days of thy life as I was with Moses, so I will be with thee. I will not fail thee, nor forsake thee. Be strong and of good courage, for unto this people shalt thou divide for an inheritance the land which I swear unto their fathers to give them. Only be thou strong and very courageous, that thou mayest observe to do according to all the law which Moses my servant commanded thee. Turn not from it to the right hand or to the left, that thou mayest prosper with whithersoever thou goest. God, you know what I'm saying? And, and that's the spirit that we, we have on us, you know, that we, you know, we're courageous coming out here. You know what I'm saying? We, we, again, we don't have that spirit of fear. We know that the Lord is upon us. So no matter where we go, whether we coming out here or we, we out in the world, you know what I'm saying? We, we um, govern ourselves according, according, you know what I'm saying, per the scripture. You know what I'm saying? We know how to deal with all these, 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 uh, these scorpions and these vipers out here. You know what I'm saying? Whether they might, you know, try to provoke us in some type of way, you know what I'm saying? talk they shit, try to, you know, start some kind of fight to get us in trouble, you know what I'm saying, people at the job, you know, spreading lies or, or whatever the case, you know what I'm saying, we, we know how to deal with all that, you know what I'm saying, because we, we can, because we can, that's what you do, it's that simple, you know what I'm saying. Was it, was it Paul, that got bit, yeah, you know, he wasn't, you know, he didn't succumb to any illness, you know, that's the, that's the most high, Doing the same thing, and uh, you know, I'm just now as an analogy. Uh, allegory, I forgot the term. But, you know, the most high, you know, even uh, if even one of these motherfuckers, you know, they do us harm, you know, it's not going to harm our spirit. You know, the most high isn't going to suffer us to be, uh, to be afflicted in a way where, you know, But hey, no, nah, through the spirit, like these people are venomous snakes, you know what I'm saying? But what they words, you know what I'm saying? What's that? Uh, oh, well, that's, a, that's another thing. We should be, uh, oh, I'll find it. I'll find it real quick. We're going to, I'll just get it. I ain't going to spoil okay, it. Kind of I ain't going to spoil it. But let, I'm going to continue on this real quick. Uh, this is uh, Joshua 1 and, and verse 8. This book of the law should not depart out of thy mouth, but thou shalt meditate therein day and night, that thou mayest observe to do according to all that is written therein. For then thou shalt make thy way prosperous, and then thou shalt have good success. You know what I'm saying? Hey, that's, that's our lot. You know what I'm saying? We're supposed to be involved in these scriptures day and night. You know what I'm saying? And, 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 and through that, you know, we'll have success. You know, Lord willing, we'll, we'll make it to the kingdom. But even if, you know, you know, as a nation, you know, we're taking a low right now, but, 
we, we have the words of Yahweh Bashim, Yahweh Shai. So no matter, you know, how down and out, whether you ain't got no job, you ain't got shovels in your pocket, you, you still in a good case, you know what I'm saying? Because you in the spirit, you know what I'm saying? And the Lord is going to provide, it's going to provide for you, you know what I'm saying? Um, Hey, that just showed that the spirit is working, man, because you had these cops, you know what I'm saying, that they, they harass people, right? They harass oh, people for, for the littlest thing, you know what I'm saying, whether it be a, a you know, they ain't turn their blinker on, they ain't stop long enough at the stop sign or a light or whatever. It's like, so what, man? Did I hurt anybody? You know what I'm saying? Is there, you know, there is, is everybody, you know what I'm saying? Everybody is good. You know what I'm saying? So it's like no harm, no foul. But yet, like I say, these cops, they'll harass people, pull them over and write these, you know, uh, ridiculous tickets for nothing. And, you know, these people, you know, they, uh, uh, they don't have that protection, so to say. You know what I'm saying? That's why, to this day, you know, you got Jake getting killed down in the street for, you know, for, for basically for nothing, you know what I'm saying? Or, or, or should I say, you know, they, they said the wrong thing, they looked like they was grabbing for something, and then they get slain in the street because also they don't have that protection, you know what I'm saying? They don't have that hedge around them, you know what I'm saying? They don't have the agents looking over them because they, they not in the, they, uh, they're not in the spirit of Yahweh by Shem Yahweh you know what I'm saying? Isaiah, they're not walking that walk, you know? Isaiah, not following the Lord. Isaiah 5, it says he took away the hedge from his garden. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I've got it. Yeah, this is uh, Luke chapter 10, verse 19. Behold, I give unto you power to tread on serpents and scorpions, and over all the power of the enemy, but nothing shall by any means hurt you. All right, this is Yahweh Shai talking. All right, and I was just relating it back. That's uh, basically the, what I was trying to say. Con, when the brother said, uh, what you said, vipers and yeah, snakes? Like, yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Con. Paul got bit by the snake. Con. And it didn't cause any, uh, any illness or harm. Con, all right, that's the, that's the power that uh, Yahweh Bashim al Shai has and is going to further bestow upon us, all right? Because when these people come up against us, they can't overtake us. And very soon, uh, physically, they're going to come against the elect and they're not going to be able to harm the elect. So we keep going, verse 20. Notwithstanding, in this rejoice not that the spirits are subject unto you, but rather rejoice because your names are written in heaven. All right, so we're gonna uh, rejoice that we're a part of that, uh, uh, that we're a part of the elect, uh, more so than that we have the power. All right, but, but either way, the Most High is still gonna put that hedge upon us. That's why we're still out here. That's why you can't, uh, you can't overthrow the words of Yahweh Bashim Al Shah. That's why the elders been out there for thirty some years. All right, the uh, uh, the slot, the. the Apostles and elders been out there for 30 some years. Or you can't overthrow this word. And the scriptures are proving it. You can look at all the examples of what happens to prophets. I think it's in Acts. Uh, I just read it. I want to I say 14 when uh, Peter had got stoned. They thought he died and he just rose back up. They took him out of the city. They stoned him. Paul. Yes. Yeah, isn't that what I said? You said Peter. Uh, oh, Slack. Like, uh, uh, Paul, he had got stoned and he rose back up. All right. So he. he, he the Lord literally uh, put the hedge on. All right. Uh, you got some on? Okay, I'm going to go back to the second address. Or you know what? Never mind. Uh, I'm going to the second address. You can get that. Let's see. This is uh, Isaiah 65. I'll just start at 1. Um, I am sought of them that ask not for me. I am found of them that sought me not. I said, Behold, behold me, behold me, unto a nation that was not called by my name. I have spread out my hands all the day unto a rebellious people which walketh in a way that was not good after their own thoughts. A people that provoked me to anger continually to my face, that sacrificed of in gardens and burned of incense upon altars of brick. No, I saw about the two thirds of our people, the way they was provoking the Lord. Right, that's why we got this place. In the, uh, we got this situation in the first place because of the the, uh, the overwhelming wickedness of the majority of the nation. Like the brother was using the example earlier, how the whole classroom was uh, fucking up except for five people. The whole classroom is still gonna go down. 
It says, which remain among the graves and lodge in the monuments which eat swine's flesh and, a, and broth of abominable things in their vessels. You know what I'm saying? Just basically going into them, you know, being defiled, being unclean. You know what I'm saying? Because these people... That's these, why he blinded them. So like, that, that's, that's the ways that they... Uh, they would say uh, in Isaiah, their hearts was uh, waxing fat and their ears heavy because our people want to be off all into their own world. They want to be a, a black man in America. They want to be a, a Mexican man uh, in, the, in the burbs somewhere raising their family. All right, people doing a 23-hour shift, cutting everybody in their great grandma grass. All right, that's what that's what our people want to do. They want to do everything except come back to the truth. That's Five why. Hours. That, that's why it's yeah. <laughs> Five dollars. That's why it's listing off. Uh, uh, every, uh, oh, yeah, damn. Uh, you can keep going on right now. Somebody hit me. Hit me out hard, so. You got something to call? Uh, oh, it's him right there. Damn. Damn, boy. I'm cigars. I'm about to put the section. I got to find it. You got something now? Yeah, yeah I'm putting it to it. 2 Corinthians, uh, Corinthians chapter 4, I'm going to start from verse 3. But, it, but if our gospel be hid, it is hid to them that are lost, and whom the God of this world hath blinded, sorry, and whom the God of this world hath blinded the minds of them which believe not, least the light of the glorious gospel of Hamashiach, who is the image of the Most High Power should shine unto them. All right, so our gospel is only hid uh, to those that are lost. All right, so if you can't understand this truth and this word, it's because the Most High ain't dealing with you. He doesn't want you to get it. All right, there's there's those that are set up for salvation, and there's those that are set up for destruction. Oh. <laughs> Let's keep going. Uh, there are those that are set up for salvation, those that are set up for destruction. Keep going. Let's keep going. Uh, Let's keep going. He's going right. in the spirit. Right. The, the truth isn't meant for everybody. All right, not just use an example of our fans right here. The Lord ain't gonna save nobody. No, no, he just, I know. Huh, just the, the Lord ain't gonna save nobody doing stuff like that. All right. Yeah. Let's keep, keep it flowing. That shit is hard, bro. Yes. Yeah, it's Romans chapter 11. So it's not different interpretations. Yeah, it's written in different languages. Uh, this is Romans chapter 11, uh, starting from verse 7. What then? Israel hath not obtained that which he seeketh for, but the election hath obtained it, and the rest were blinded. All right, it's still gone. The, the elect are the only ones that are going to get it. The two thirds of our people are blinded. All right, they're not meant to receive this word. That's that's why the Lord keeps us protected. That's why when you see. Uh, and when you look at things that happen in the news, like that dude, uh, Philandro Castell, that got uh, blazed up, Trayvon Martin got blazed up in the grass. All right, Lord, that, that's the punishment upon them, because they don't want to adhere to this word. They want to be uh, 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 niggas in the world. That's how the Most High is going to treat them. All right, I'm, they, they don't want to come back to their heritage. They don't want to come out and do this every week. That's how the Lord is going to uh, uh, deal with them. So the Lord oh, oh, what's that scripture? I will plead with them. But, uh, I'm going to find it. I'm going to keep going. I'm going to plead with my people. You're going to go to each I'm going to just find it. I know, I know how it is. I can find it's, it's it. It's, uh, I'm going to keep going. Romans 11 and 8. According as it is written, the Most High Power hath given them the spirit of slumber, eyes that they should not see, ears that they should not hear, unto this day. All right, so they're not going to be able to get it uh, all the way up to this day until they're destroyed. That's when, that's when our people uh, as a whole will be all right. But up until then, they're they going to be blasphemers. They're going to be uh, adulterers. All right, they're going to be. Uh, what's the word that starts? We can go and look up with certain. Uh, 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 treason, coffers, uh, all right, coons, they're going to be uh, everything that's wicked in the world because the Lord kept them blind. Hey, you, you just, you're just looking like uh, how Esau has certain things, like for instance, uh, 
if uh, you got you got different type of learning disabilities, you know, according to Esau. And you know, if you got a learning disability, you can't, you know, you're not going to excel in that specific category. You know, if you uh, uh, if, if, if you're considered a learning disabled, and you can be like learning disabled in certain things, but you can excel something else. Like somebody who's not uh, uh, good with, uh, you know, social skills, you know, they, 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 that'd be considered almost like a learning disability. And just like how you got learned learning disability there, you got a learning disability where you can't learn this truth. Where most high just seals it up and you just you just can't learn it. And there's nothing that you can do, just like how you got some people that just, they just can't learn certain stuff. You know, like somebody who's uh, a, a so-called mentally retarded, they can't, you know, learn, you know, to a complete capacity. You, you can't learn this. And that's just how the most I just set it up. Spiritually retarded. Yeah. This is uh, Isaiah 66 and 15. For behold, Yahweh Bashim al Shai will come with fire and with his chariots like a whirlwind to render his anger with fury and his rebuke with flames of fire. Verse 16. For by fire and by his sword will Yahweh Bashim al Shai plead with all flesh the slain of Yahweh Bashim al Shai will be many. So that's how the Lord's gonna plead with everybody. You don't wanna adhere to this word, you don't wanna listen. You wanna be a, a, a nigga in the world, you wanna have fun every day. You think uh, life is a joke, you think uh, you think being a free American is the way to go, the Lord is gonna plead with you uh, with fire, with the second death that's mentioned in Revelation. All right, just, that, that, that's how he's gonna uh, deal with all the inhabitants of the world, especially the two thirds of our people. Uh, yeah, so, uh, Okay. So just how every other you bring it up. You know what I'm saying? Because, uh, yeah, God, you know, we, we prophesy, you know what I'm saying? We share the words of the Heavenly Father, you know what I'm saying? Which, like I said before, is grace and is mercy. And um, it's, it's a sign of, of end times. At the same time, uh, the Most High, he, he, um, he says for signs in the heavens. You know what I'm saying? Whether it be uh, so-called uh, falling stuff.